in, forward, or backward, depending on where it's set up the best for what I'm trying to do. I don't want to move the spindle around my leg. I move my leg and my wrist around the spindle. So what you want ultimately is for right here where your thumb connects to your wrist to be locked in right here. If you're way out here, spindle is going to be all over the place and that's, that works against you. So the inside instep of your foot is going to be probably half an inch, maybe an inch, three quarters of an inch from the edge of the socket. So right about there. Lock that mess in like yay. Now I'm going to make a tripod with my body. I want everything on my side, in front of me about two feet, behind me two feet, and everything on the side to be open. If not, you're banging your wrist on stumps and people and all kinds of stuff. You don't want anything getting your way. See how I'm sitting? I'm not sitting back on my, my sit bones on my butt. I'm up. I'm like I'm, I'm in the yeah, second stage body. of standing up from a sitting position. Like, yay. Make sense? Palm the bow. Hold on to it. If you're holding here, you're making too much work for yourself. Palm the bow, and I like to put my thumb on the string. Now at first, just get your feel for it. If, if this is doing this, lock your wrist into your leg. And if you throw your arm around your leg, I'm leaning on my leg. My torso is leaning on my leg right here. I don't want to be up too high because then I'll do this and it's a lot harder to get that downward pressure and keep it in one place. You want your arm, your forearm, which is a, a long spindle helps with this, to be as horizontal as you can. And that's it, bro. Big, long strokes. Palm in the bow. The butt of the bow is right in your palm. What is it being horizontal helps with? It helps you to manage this. If your wrist is like this, you're trying to push down, and the joint is right here, and it so makes it... Push out or something? Yeah. Here is hard to keep it where you want. Mm -hmm. Here is easier. A shorter spindle makes it harder. Longer spindle, if my spindle was up here, that would be even easier. Lock your wrist into your knee. I'm right over top bone in my shin, like yay. Whoops. If you don't push down hard enough, that's what happens. And that probably will. And if this thing is wound up right, boing, boing, the spindle will go over into Morgan County. Awesome. Now from here, you will practice how much downward pressure and speed you're looking for. That's it, bro. Especially pine and hemlock. Okay, I'm not deep enough yet. Not deep enough yet. I would continue to go, and that's exactly the consistency of what I'm looking for. Maybe a little dark, but exactly the consistency I'm looking for until I've got that nice and clean burned in. Any questions? 